Penny. 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 That's just wrong. All right, let's go. Would you hold on? Before we get to the courthouse, I'd like to call on your skills as an actress. What is this? I've taken the liberty of scripting your appearance on the witness stand because, let's face it, you're somewhat of a loose cannon. Now, <laughs> don't worry, it's written in your vernacular, so shall we rehearse? Do I have a choice? Well, of course you have a choice. Although we live in a deterministic universe, each individual has free will. Now sit down. <laughs> I call your attention to the events of November 16th. Do you remember that date? Darn tootin', I do. <laughs> If the court will excuse my homespun, corn-fed, Nebraskan turn of phrase. Excellent. Go on. The reason that date is, like, so totally fixed in my memory is that I had the privilege to be witness to one of the most heroic acts I've ever seen in, like, ever. And who performed that heroic act? Why, you did, sir. You, Dr. Sheldon Cooper. And may I add, it is a privilege to know you. There's no need for compliments. This court is only interested in the facts. But it is a fact that it's a privilege to know you. Totally. A, a teardrop rolls down my cheek. It's only a suggestion. A catch in your throat would work just as well. But it is a fact that it's a privilege to know you. Totally. Maybe you should put on your juicy pants again. 